Let's go talk to Jaunty, because clearly I'm missing something. Maybe I can also use the baton outside of Deadside, maybe? I'm not too sure, because I don't have the yellow bar available. I like how I'm immediately getting perceived as soon as I spawn here. Why is that not equipped? At least I can stab some people, I can shank a bitch. So, whoop. Stop with the dilly dallying, Michael, and get yourself over here. Talk to me, please. Long time no see, Michael. I have found and taken a dark soul. Nettie was right about them. This is the same dialogue Never as before. Have I experienced such hatred and corruption. The dark fire burns within me. This is the same. That I... That's the same dialogue. There's nothing new here. Okay. So maybe I've got to explore this area a bit more. You found the answer to why I can't open the front door. If it's if it's a little bit further ahead than where I was having trouble, then tell me. If it's too far ahead, don't. Or if it's an item that I do not have yet, and I will not get for a while, also, well, let me know that, but don't tell me what the item is and how far away it is. I know that's a lot to ask, but... <laughs> I don't want to be completely spoiled, but what? Hang on a minute! Torches! I knew I was forgetting something in the beginning here. Maybe I can light these up with my little, uh... Well, my little arson. I get it, I get it now. Arson. Fire. That's pretty clever. But I need some skulls to get some energy. Might have to go back to the, uh, gate, uh, to the, um... Actually, some pots here. There we are. There's some ammo. You provide when I need it. Okay, hang on. Maybe we've got something here. Oh, whoops. Uh, doo -doo -doo. There we are. Right. Uh, boop. What? Double what? I do need another item. Fair enough. Right, so what do I do with these? Can I not like... These look like these were supposed to be a lid. No. I thought these were torches I'm supposed to light. That is not the case. Not the case, it seems. Okay. Oh, oh whoops, no, I'm trying to dequip it. There we are. So that's not the case. Get up there, please. Let's see what we can do around here. I guess I'll just cut around till I find something. Maybe I can do something with this? Probably not, because these are two shooty items. And I didn't shoot every single one of these pots, that's a demand a, a caddo there. A caddo here. So at least I'm cleaning up this area now, which I said I was going to do at some point, I just haven't got around to doing it until now. Fire. Fire? Uh, possibly fire? No? I don't get it, man. So, they, they, look, something that looks like a torch. Not lit. Let me try to light it. Doesn't work. Panels with a fire symbol on it. Try to light it on fire. Nothing happens. I, I don't get the visual clues. I don't get it. Fire equals fire, right? Use the fire thing on the fire thing. Use... The coconuts on the coconut switch. I, I, I don't get it, man. I honestly don't. Why did you swap hands with that? I, I don't know. I'm really having trouble with the inventory. There we are. There, there's another caddo, a caddo right after that corridor with the fire things. There's another uh, caddo. Alright, I've gone through the entirety of the first section. Didn't really see anything else other than the caddo that I missed to interact with. This is the first door that requires practically nothing because it's your introduction to the mechanic. And this would take us back to where we got the Book of Prophecies. This is our first warp point. Yeah, this is our first warp point. So I'm still missing something. I didn't see any other ways to go. I didn't see anything else to interact with. I found two things I could have interacted with, but nothing happened. 
Maybe I'm going to go back to Louisiana at this point. I mean, that's the only other thing I haven't done yet. I haven't seen if any of the other items I've grabbed can actually work outside of Deadside. Guess that's what we'll try and do to Louisiana. I mean, we haven't got any new abilities or anything. The only the weapons might be able to do something. Don't know. We'll just have to try. Maybe Nessie might be able to tell us something as well. She might be able to say something new. Hopefully. I hope so. I'm lost. I have two, two Damas, two Govies, excuse me, two meat cakes right here. Wait, where is she? Oh, she's. Followed the Dark Souls trail into the asylum, but where the hell are the five? They're in this world, Shadow Man. Five mortal men touched by the power of the Dark Souls. Unlike you, they don't have the mask of shadows controlling and channeling the dark power. It twists their minds, fills their already tainted hearts with even greater perversions, and a hatred so terrible it has sent them insane. Okay, so they're in this world, but where exactly? That's your job, Shadow Man. You gotta go back to the asylum and find a way through. The same way the Dark Souls found their way into the Five. Hunt the mothers down, Shadow Man, and kick their sorry asses. But remember, they possess an immortal power, and only by taking their souls will you truly defeat them. Okay, so the people I need to take out will be in the living realm and not uh, deaf side, but... That still doesn't tell me anything on how to get through the asylum. She's just basically saying, you have to go through there. So, we were, we only jumped the gun a little bit. Yes, we missed out two items, but one of them I could have got on the way. The other one I wasn't aware of until I found that location. But that's not the point. So, I can't shoot these. Oh, they're darkened out. They're darkened out. I can't do anything with these. I can't equip them. I'm still just as weak as I was, and that's just a pistol. <sighs> I might have to go back to the asylum. But I would love to open the front door so I don't have to keep going through the bloody sewers. That would be the best thing. So there was nothing I could do over here. Because there's nothing I can interact with here. Going in here does nothing for me except kill me. Because that's probably acid or I just can't survive a drop that high. So that's useless. I don't want to kill the dogs. That's not an option. Because <laughs> I'm a nice chap. There is a... So how do I use this if I can't... If I can't open the govies for the Dark Souls, how can I interact with this with the baton? I need to be Shadow Man. So how do I do that? My god, you are all surrounding me. Could you all back off, please? <laughs> Not in the best of moods. Do I go through the asylum again? I guess that will be the last thing I'll try and do. I found other places to go. I got more Dark Souls, and I've even got two items. But those two items do nothing to the environment except for warping, which the only warp that, you know, I haven't interacted with before, instant kills me by spawning me in lava. What does this game want me to do? I don't understand. I guess I just have to try the asylum again. But I don't really want to be trying the asylum again, despite having these items that can act as weapons, because... I want to open the bloody front door. But I'm not able to open the front door. I want to know what this Stargate is when I'm alive. In my HUD. What does the Stargate mean? Once I'm back in, de in Dead Side, it's different. And the cheat that we got does buggering nothing. We still can't interact with these that you said that I don't have the item for, so that's confirmation of some sort, but the point is, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. So I guess I'll just go, oh whoops, I guess I'll just go through this again like we did at the beginning of the bloody stream. I mean that was the first four, pretty much 45 minutes of the stream, now we're back here again about an hour and a half later. With two new weapons and one additional Dark Soul, well that's it. 
didn't increase my capacity of any kind. I found the place to, to increase my health, but I don't have enough ca uh, Caddo, I only have half the amount. And that's exploring all the areas that I've already been in a lot more thoroughly. Why did I do that? I shouldn't have done that. You get what I mean? It's like... I'm out of options. I've got to go back through this again and use the new items. Yeah, I, w I, I would appreciate I mean, I guess you could say how far away I am. If I'm nowhere near, then... That's okay, because then I don't know when to expect it. But if I'm close, don't tell me. I mean, I, I, I guess it's because it's open world to a certain extent. That is a good thing. Because that means that it gives you the incentive to explore like a Metroid game. But the dead ends just feel a bit too punishing, you know. And these hookmen, you can fight them off if you know how to dupe them out. Which I was doing. But that's definitely not the intended way to do it. And it's a bit ridiculous. And if they're all alive again, I'm going to use up all my ammo on them. Yeah, I wouldn't like it if they had, but that is a very high probability of them actually doing so. I mean, all the enemies are back alive in the in the gate area where Jaunty is, so that would make sense. Then again, it's the same play session. Yeah, I hear oinks. Yep, they're all back again. Oh. <laughs> Am I really going to stop another stream at the exact same point? We've we have made progress, sure, but... I'm still here, you know? Put that on there. Put that on there. I don't know what the better item is, but... I know that this ta the, the, uh, the arson takes a lot less energy than the uh, other thing, but here, I can pop these guys off. Oh, I just realised, I've got my weapon drawn and I need to jump up here quick. I'm not going to be able to because I haven't got a free hand. No, 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 back off, back off, firing both weapons, firing both weapons, and I'm dead. Oh no, I killed him! He's weak to fire! He is weak to fire. He died super quick. Hello? Information? Gaining the lore? That's nice to know. But that means I've got limited ammo. Okay. We know what rooms to avoid. That room we can avoid. Unless he pops out of the room, but I'm pretty sure we can avoid that room. He might stay in there just hacking away. Hopefully. There's the bloody front door again. Oh, I can't bloody open. Uh, we want to avoid that room as well. We just want to be going straight through. This ticking or hacking is really not good for my health right now. <laughs> Why did I hear a roar when I came over here? That's scary, please don't. I've set you on fire. No, I'm not safe stating, I refuse. I want to play this as intended. I've already struggled through enough already, I was tempted, but I wasn't gonna. That bloody two jumps. I see you over there. Can I lock onto you? I can lock onto you from here as well. Nope. Burn! Burn you fool! Burn you fool! There we are! A couple of flames and you are gone! Back to the depths of hell with you! Now the problem is because I'm, I'm ignoring all these rooms. Where'd you come from? I see you. You just faced through the f door. The th I was waiting for the door to open. He just faced through the bloody door. Wah! This has got no more energy. Uh, put that away. Ah, feck. Put that away. Get that out. I need to stab a bitch. I'm not even safe with doors. 
They can just phase through them. Why do they just ignore the door? That's not that hard to animate when an enemy approaches a door. That is cheeky beyond belief. That is bad game design. They just phase through the bloody door. I couldn't even see him. I knew he was behind the door, but I was waiting for the door to open because... If, look, the door blocks my shots. Doesn't block his weapon, though. That is dirty. And where did he come from anyway, by the way? Where did he come from? This room? Yeah, he just decided to leave his room. So if I, go t if I ignore one and go too far, they will come after me anyway, so I can't skip any of them. I have to take them all on. That is super dirty. And I just realised I have 240 frames uh, dropped. So I have to deal with the one in here. I'm going to have to stab him. That's all I've got. Actually, those are just normal enemies. Yeah, where's the other one in here? These weapons are definitely helping out, though, I will admit. I hear you. I hear you. Why were you oinking? Doors are not my friend. They actually block my vision and my shot, so now I've heard an oink, I am super paranoid. As if I wasn't paranoid already trying to deal with these bl bloody bastards. Ah! At least I'm killing them quick. At least I'm killing them quick. They're not really much of a threat now. Since so it, I mean, the flames from the baton are doing tons more damage than the uh, than the arson. But at the same time, the arson takes a lot less power to use, and I can still stack it with my gunshots to do chip damage. But at the same time as well, the baton can still do the same amount of damage at close range by stabbing them, which is really saving my life here because it's actually knocking them back and paralyzing them for a second. So I might actually be able to push through. So I have gained power. I have gained power. That's a good thing. Question is, can I... Question, can I interact with this or do I need a later item as well? Because I don't know what this is about. I didn't mean to waste a shot, but I wanted to try and use the weapon to see if it would activate it. I will say though, the camera doesn't get stuck on walls. Which is what I can is something that I cannot say for a lot of games. Alright, there was a dude that came out here before, so. I entered the room and then I got bombarded and I want to know why it's not happening now. Why is it not happening this time? Last time I thought I was safe and I wasn't and it's happening again, I don't know. I don't know. I honestly don't know. There wasn't one down there. Right, so the one here is what killed me last time. But I've killed all the enemies up to this point. I could probably get back here again. Well, yeah, the camera doesn't get stuck on the walls. It's always... But look, it's always behind me. 
it doesn't get stuck on the wall, so the camera's definitely better in this game. It's just the tank controls and how the camera works in that regard is what messes me up. Nope, nope. Come on then, if you want to come over here. Pibooski! Come on! One stab is enough to burn him after a couple of shots. That was the perfect test. This thing is so good. This is what I needed this whole time. And this was the item that I didn't even know was there. I knew about the other one, but that was the, the, the flame, the, the arson, not this. Another locked door. Can't go through it. Another one. Here, another one. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. There's a trunk. Oh, I see you. I see you, fool. Come at me, bro. What the? Where did he come from? No. Stab him, stab him, we're walking back, stab him, stab him, stab him. Stab him, no, come on. Where did the second one come from? Can they walk through locked doors as well? Another locked door, can't go through it. Why can they just ignore doors? I'm the shadow man, I should be able to go through doors. I died because they were phasing through not just shut doors, but locked doors. If there was one behind that door, where did that second one come from? From the right of me. There was another path to the left, I know that, but he came at the right, behind me. Excuse me. That is not fair. This game is being cheap for no reason. Shit, I just realised. Kill myself. Kill myself. I need to get skulls. I haven't got any. I need more ammo. It's not a bad platforming segment, it's actually really well done, it's not that difficult. It's just... They can not only walk through doors, but they can walk through locked doors? That, that seems overkill. They're already breaking the laws of physics, and then they break... It's, I don't know, it's... That just rubs me the wrong way, that's not fair. I mean, I didn't even know he was behind that door. And even when you know that they're behind the door, they can hit you, but you can't hit them because the door blocks your attacks. It's not fair game design. The door should be open, and if it's if it is openable, and if it's locked, they can't get through it. Plus, my bullets are spiritual anyway. Why does the wall stop it? Maybe it's because this is all spiritual. Because why would you have like a rock building in a spiritual plane? But you know semantics and all that. But if you're gonna follow one form of logic, then you gotta follow it all the way through. You can't just break my immersion like that. It's dumb. Alright, back again. You want to be cheap? You want to be dirty? You want to be an asshole? You want to walk through any more doors? You want to stop walking through walls next? I'm legit pissed off about that. I'm still fuming. I might as well just phase through walls at this point. It's so cheeky. At least it didn't take me that long to get back here this time, because I haven't got to be worried about... Cheeky bastard, get out of here! Facing through bloody locked doors, I swear. See, look! Locked door! I There was nothing here because I only came in one way, can't go through a locked door. I was standing here, pummeling shots to that one over there, and it came out the right. The only place he could have came from was through that door, which is locked because I can't go through it. I didn't even know there was one behind that door. That is dirty. That is evil. And if he came through here, then he somehow cycled around me. That's not fair. Right, can I open these at all? Nope. I appreciate the pun to lighten the mood. <laughs> I guess you'd say I am burning with rage right now. So I can go up here, which is an immediate good thing. Let's equip items, get up there quick. Right, so I can get up here, which is an immediate good thing. That's more uh, stuff to dodge. 
That's a drop and a half. I can't even see down there. Okay. Let's get our weapons back out. Wait, hang on. Put them away. I can go up here too. Oh, that's where I just was. Oh. Okay, so that loops around. I guess I could have done that to get cheap uh, chip down the dude here if I was if I was quick enough. Because he'll be stuck down here and I could get a better angle. But at this point, you can kill him pretty easily with the uh, with the baton. But wait, hang on. Does that mean there was another area around here I could jump up? No, it doesn't look like it. Right. Let's have a go if you think you're hard enough. Safe room? Safe room! Nice to know. Ammo. Two caddies. Yes, please. Can I interact with anything here? Probably not. It's just a stock room, it seems. Okay, then. I guess I could have camped up here as well to save myself. Okay, so I'm going to have to go through these gut ducts because the only other doorway is locked. Although, saying that, there is another way I haven't gone yet. And that's back down here. I want to go back. I don't know if I'm going the right way or not. But what's this way? Get my weapons out. Plus, I got stocked up on weaponry, so I'm fine for now. Hello, Dark Soul! That's too easy for the pickings. I say too easy at this stage. Uh, there's another one up there! I didn't even realise I was locking onto that one. I was after that one. Are you serious? There's nothing in here? That can't be it. Well, I've got to drop down from below for that one. That one, however, is just sitting there. What's the catch? Get it, what's the catch? Because of the hooky people. I'm going to shoot this. And I'm going to back into it, because I don't trust it. Are mine. Progress. Seems like we're safe in here. More Cadius. I'm saying Cadius again, aren't I? It's Cado, you melon. Alright, so good thing I did come back here because uh, I can't actually do anything else in here, it seems. Oh, hang on a minute. Maybe if I just jump. Nope, it is too high. Yeah, good thing I came back because I would have missed that otherwise, so... Happy days. And funnily enough, I could have actually got that before I, you know, went up here and got killed by the one charging down the hallway. On the, well, at the very beginning of this particular stream, this recording session. Don't forget to save. Don't worry, I won't. In fact, I'll do it right now, even though we are near the end. But I do appreciate the reminder. Wait, did I press save? I did press save. Boop. There we are. All done. Thank you. Oh, oops. Button. The controls are still getting to me, but I've adapted. Right, so onwards, I guess. I'm not going to get bombarded here, am I? Oh, Jesus. Okay. Wait. Wait, what? Did I go the wrong way? Did I end up back where I started in this entire zone? God damn it, I did. Wow, I went, I took the wrong shoot. It's just surreal at this point that I'm just able to, pr like, prowl around in this area. Not even giving a shit about these uh, hook enemies, because I've killed them all. As long as I don't, you know, leave the area or turn off the game or something. I'm just literally running around like a lemon. Just not caring. So I've got to go down this way. Oh god, they, this got dark. Oh, I can go both ways. Oh god, choices. Oh my god, choices. Wait, what's this? That's a hook man. No, that's not a hook man. That's another one of those, um... Things that we've seen twice on the, 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 at the doorstep, basically. The, the, the front door. We've seen those at the front door. Meanwhile, uh, wait, wait, why can't I not find my gun? I always have it equipped. Excuse me. Thank you. I didn't fire my gun. 
Normally when pressing the button, you always whip out your gun. What happened there? Oh, I can't go anywhere else other than just those two at the back here. I thought there was uh, more to it than that. Fair enough. So we'll just follow this around then. Uh, I want that there. Ah, I want that in my B. Because I don't, I can't actually see if there's any enemies. Draw them in. Nope. Uh, target, target, target. Nope, I don't see anything to target. This is dangerous, this is dumb, this is dangerous, this is dumb. I think I'm right behind that door that we already f found. Maybe I'll get the item here. That's the item, isn't it? That's the bloody item I wanted this entire stream. Engineer's key. The engineer's key. I actually have to have it equipped. It's like a fist. What does it do? Oh, it's like a hook. It's a hook hand. Help. Thank you for not spoiling it, mate. I hear something approaching. What does this do, quick? It doesn't actually do anything. This is useless to me at this particular po po point in time. Equip that. I don't feel safe without my lance. Oh, dear! Hello there, buddy! You don't mind if I, uh, you know... Uh, no, not that. Uh, get out the strafing. Actually, he can't shoot me from that angle. Maybe I can shoot him? He's standing right next to a dark soul. How cheeky are you? BAP HIM! He's too far away. He can't hit me, I can't hit him. But that did give me a bit of a jump scare. Alright, let's get the key out. There's no point uh, doing anything here. Oh, he did get- he did shoot me. Cheeky bastard. Alright, fair enough then. Uh, BAP IT! There we are. Can I deactivate it whenever I want? No, nope, it just opens them. Oh, God. That is not what I was expecting to be. Uh, nope. Uh, there and there. Feck. There and there. Why is he looking up? Oh! That wasn't the front door. I was getting mad this whole time thinking that was the front door. That's not the front door. I'm back in the hallway again, aren't I? Yep. Yep! <laughs> it wasn't the hallway! <sighs> I thought it was the- I thought that was the, the entrance. It was actually where- it, Where I was saying that I need an item in order to open up the entrance, it was not the entrance, but it was the item for it. God damn it, I can't interact with this. Still. 